Uganda music has come a long way starting from 50 years ago and right now there's definitely been a big transition. So what I decided to do is to compare the times from when music started 50 years ago up to now. All right, this is a tribute to the music over the years. I hope you enjoy it. Uganda music has come a long way from when it started 50 years ago until now. There were times where musicians could have freely expressed in their music, but that has all changed now. <laughs> The music industry has evolved over time as the technology has also evolved and the songs that used to be seven minutes long have now been cut down to two and a half or three minutes. In the era of our grandparents, music started with the simple drums and other local instruments like the adungu, xylophones, and also other locally made instruments. Music was so simple then and all the people cared about was the message in the songs, no matter how long the track was. I managed to catch up with our Frigo band to see what they had to say about the evolution of music since they came onto the scene. So basically Uganda had uh, people with talent in the music for a long time. For a long time. Yes. And uh, even the fans, these fans, uh, the followers of the band, uh, they were capable of uh, knowing every tempo because they could dance towards Foxtrot, Quick Step, Cha Cha, uh, Bolelo, Calypso. Uh, then time came when the Congolese also improved and changed to Sukus, Kavasha. So people used to enjoy and they knew how to dance. There has been many legendary musicians in Uganda who did the first genre of music in Uganda, which was known as the Kadongo Kambo. This music was very simple but with so much passion and purity in the messages communicated. I would describe this era of music as the era when music made sense. Music these days has lost meaning as a song is not considered unless it has a video to it. Technology and the media has gotten us hooked on the visuals other than the message that is being passed in the music. Fifty years from now or years from now, where do you see music, Ugandan music? Actually, side A, mm. the music is going. I mean, it, it, it is, uh, at least it is promising. Yeah. On side B, some... <laughs> We, 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 we have quantity, but we should look for the quality. We're losing focus. Yeah, somehow. But it's not the end. Mm. There's still room for improvement. Yeah. yeah. We are also starting to see musicians these days starting to remix the old songs to fit into the new generation style. <laughs> I 
hope you guys have seen how far back music has come from. Anyways, unfortunately, that's all I had for you this week. But keep it locked to NTV and I'll be right back next week, same time. If you have any comments or messages, send the word login to 6565 or leave me a message on Facebook. For now, I'm your girl, Robin Kisti, and happy independence.